Hello and welcome back to Stardew Valley. Uh, rerun. What do you have to tell us? Neutral. Yay. The weather is sunny and clear all day. Wow. Where is the rain? I mean, occasionally isn't there supposed to be rain? I've heard of this wondrous phenomenon. I think I've seen it once in, in here. But the rain has eluded us thus far. I should probably check in on Ralph, see if he's scared away any more crows. I know last time you were wondering, how? How ever did you lose that massive lake that's supposedly in the middle of your yard? Magically. Yes. No, I just get really turned around pretty easy, I guess. Now we need to get some more water, and today we are basically going to look into potentially going and dealing with the community center a little bit more than what we have been thus far. And on that note, we're going to say hi to the cat. Sheldon, keep away from the paths. We don't want to uh, be blocked by the cat. Yep, two more. We can go ahead and finish that one off, I believe. So let's go do that. We shouldn't have too much needing to go on today. But what I would really like to do is foraging. Yes, we would like to get some foraging done. Why? Because these berries are around for a limited time and they would make great snacks we're going into the mines. And let's go this way. Berry bushes! Really? Just, just two? Ah, I came all this way. Let's check over in this direction. Yeah, I would also like to try and get some money for the spring dance. Hopefully there will be something good that we can get there. But if not, then it's a shame, but oh well. I should probably check the calendar. I say this walking the other direction. Come here. Hmm. Nope. Nope. Nothing. Nothing. Yes. Walking the other direction, I say. Let's check the calendar. Here we go. And, um... I realized that I was... Ooh, very Less than clear about how to level up your mining last time. So, let me... Spell it a bit more easily to understand. As long as the rocks are destroyed by your doing one way or another, then it is fine. You could use a bomb, you could, I guess, destroy them somehow while destroying monsters. Doesn't particularly matter how you destroy them, just as long as you destroy them. Speed grow. Yes. I... I don't really know how speed grow works. Ooh, let's see, what are you gonna do? And you're... I have a feeling you're gonna give me more work. Those tiles equal more work. Oh. Hee <laughs> look. Cute Junimo. Okay, okay, I will let you get back to walking. There you go. Have fun walking. Let's go see what this one wants us to do. Of course, I don't need to walk all this way, but I like doing that. Adventurers! Uh, no thanks. Geologists! Ah, yes, we have one of these and one of those. That one's going to take more time. Now, 
onward to foraging. But I should probably double check because I don't want to accidentally miss anyone's birthday. And I know I did not get the sunfish because, oh, berries. Yes, blame the berries. No, no, not really. I did not get the sunfish because, um, I do not lack, well, I, I do lack the, uh, persistence to keep paying attention. No! Hmm. Feeling gloomy? Uh, I will accept that and uh, I will go see if I have one more potato. Sebastian, this all depends on if I have a potato. I, I don't know why a potato would make him feel better, but he wants a potato. Honestly, I, I would not have taken him for a potato person, maybe. Hmm. More along the lines of- oh, I have three. More along the lines of cauliflower or something, but hey, a potato is much cheaper, so. I have a potato. Oh, yeah, wait, I wanted to get rid of this. Where will I find him? We will only have a few deterrents, such as, can I find him? All this grass. And I found it! See, I knew it was around here. Although that doesn't help me with the watering cans or anything. But here we go. We have berries. These are some very annoying berries. They, they don't want to be picked. And if they get picked, they don't want to come to me. It's almost as if they're going, no, you will... You will eat us. Yeah, they're... Wait, they're not sentient berries. They're just annoying berries. What? I, I guess I haven't been the best at keeping this place cleared out, have I? Well, we're doing something about it now. I probably should be doing this on my farm, honestly. I say this while holding a potato that I need to take to Sebastian. Does anyone know his schedule? I don't. Hmm. Onwards. What? I, I probably need to go ahead and change this so that way I can see a little bit further out. Because I know that there's rabbits. I just don't really see them until they're running. Which begs the question of, how would you go about attacking a rabbit? You know, for the rabbit's foot, how would you do that? Do you just cross your fingers and hope for the best? Or is that a deal where you need a slingshot? Hmm, I imagine a slingshot would be very helpful in that matter. But in the meantime, we are going to get these berries. Ah! And more berries. Threatening to jump in water berries, that's what they are. Yeah, Sebastian should most definitely be awake now. I have a feeling, nagging feeling that I should be doing something else, but I'm not doing it. Oh, no! I need to hurry up. Hurry up, get to wherever Sebastian is, maybe... Get some more berries on the way. I sure hope these, uh, berries are helping with, uh, leveling up. Foraging. Uh, I know, I could not find a decisive yes or no does berry foraging help level up? I saw the most beautiful family of butterflies sunning themselves in the town garden yesterday. Oh, that's a very pretty story. Ah, oh. Hey, stop! Yuck! Oh, well. Hmm. Tax collection, mumble, mumble. Spring festivities, expenses, mumble, mumble. Hmm. Yes, now go along, go along. Nothing to see here. I probably should have double checked. 
make sure uh, somebody wasn't there before I started doing that. Oh well. Where would a Sebastian be? I found a Dimitri. No, I remember what we were supposed to do today. You're probably growing a lot of interesting plants on your farm, huh? Yeah, today we were supposed to do the silo. Okay, well, the grass isn't going anywhere. I, well, actually, it is going anywhere. It's going somewhere. It's going everywhere. That's what it's doing. So, it's not hurting us. It's a bit dreary. Hey there, flying cat. I was just daydreaming about some new carpentry projects. Oh, don't get too lost in thought, you know. Now that I know what time you're open, I'm fully planning on trying to get you t Where is he? Don't tell me he's in his room. Yeah, he's in his room. You're not good enough for him. Yep. I guess I'll have to come back later and cross my fingers and hope he's outside of that room. I don't care what you're doing. Just let me in where you're working on the computer so I can give you the potato you want. It's for your benefit. Trust me. Dun, da, da, dun. On Tuesdays and Thursdays, I work at Harvey's clinic. He says he likes having me around in case his medical equipment goes haywire. Okay, I'm concerned now. Why would his medical equipment be going haywire? Hmm. Oh. Looks like a good day to play catch, huh? If you weren't a girl, I'd ask you to play catch. I'm fine just watching you from a distance. I want to play catch with you. Angry. What's that supposed to mean? Hmm. All very good choices. I don't think I'd want to play catch with him simply for his attitude. I want to play catch... Hmm. I am torn. Very torn. We'll be angry! Uh, never mind. Do you like this? Uh, okay, thanks. We're gonna go with a, uh, not particularly. But that's fine. Oh, whatever. We're gonna go say hi to Shane. No, I don't have time to chat with you. Well, you're just sitting there drinking. Are you sure? Sigh. Hey, kid. You're too young to be moping around in a place like this. Oh, that's fairly good philosophy. Good evening. Can I get you anything? Nope. Passing by. I've heard rumors of rare and powerful magic rings forged long ago by forgotten civilizations. I'm not sure if it's true or just a fairy tale. Oh, that definitely sounds neat. <sighs> hey, kid, you're too young to be moping around in a place like this. I, I know. I thought you were going to say something different. I spilled a whole bucket of milk on the flour today. It was horrible and such a waste of my poor Belinda's hard work. That That is a massive shame. Massive shame. Now, um... Ah! No, oh, I already did that. Ah! Yes. Now, here we go. Cross our fingers and hope Sebastian is uh, moping around the area up there. Preferably in an area I can find him. Because I would like to get this out of the way sooner rather than later. Well, there goes Robin. And... Seriously, where is this guy? Oh, there's berries up here, so it's not a, a complete waste. Yeah. Hmm. I'm sure Linus is supposed to be around somewhere. He's probably in his tent by now. 
I don't know you well enough to trust you. Sorry. Uh, here you go. This is a great gift. Thank you. Don't mention it. I found it outside your hut. I mean, tent. I found it outside your tent. Yes. Oh no! I can't walk in their house now, can I? Hurry, hurry, run, run! And... Hmm. I can't tell where anyone is. That's a shame. I wanted to give it to him today. I guess I'll have to look up that guy's schedule. Ugh. What a pain. All because he asked for something? Can't he just come outside of his room? He's like, hey Sebastian, join the living for ten minutes, please. Preferably ten minutes when I'm around. Or just open up the door. In the meantime, we're getting berries. Why? They're great sources of energy. And we have a lot of energy, speaking of which. So since we're not giving him a potato, we might as well make good use of this energy. And chop down some trees. Or geodes? Yeah, we're not chopping down geodes. We we don't chop down geodes here. Trees. Level up my foraging, please. Come on. Hmm. Although that doesn't leave us with much to do with the way of selling items. All we did was run around, shake bushes, and now hitting trees with axes. And really, when does Sebastian come outside of his room? I will have to look that up. And here we go. Give me your seeds that's on the ground. I, I can just replant them where I want them later. Still have a lot of energy. A little bit of time. Let's hurry it up. Leaves us with, what are we going to sell to get a little bit of money? Sap, come here. You are a bit too sappy for me. Yes, you are. All right, one, two. I guess we'll drop that in there. Why are these in here? It's random. Oh, it's because I have absolutely no organizational skills, right? One, two... I know what we're gonna sell. It came to me. Inspiration. From above. Oh. Or it could have just been right there. <laughs> So I hope you remember to hit the like button, don't forget to come back, and subscribe so you can see more episodes. Tomorrow is Pam's birthday, and I do look forward to sharing that with you, and seeing if she likes parsnips. And, well, it's not what I was going for, but I will not complain, I will definitely take it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, and hope you have a wonderful day.